Hi everyone, welcome back. Today we're going to be creating a Mandy using three colors from Lift Your Spirit Dips and these new colors are from the Down to Earth collection. Now the first color here is called Old Fashioned and it is a beautiful nudie butterscotch color and it's super pretty and I really like this color a lot and it pairs perfectly with this next one called Trusty Boots. Now Trusty Boots is the perfect red clay dip powder and it also has shimmer to it and it's very pretty so it looks a little bit of orangish brown in some lights but it's definitely a true clay color and then this fun one right here is called worn out favorite jeans so this is a very unique dip powder so it's like that blue jean color but then it has like these clay pieces in there which are super unique and super fun and they're very pretty and it just makes this color combination here pop with that sheer jean blue color and then that nude color and then i'm obsessed with this collection in general so here's the whole entire collection the down the earth collection it's so pretty it's a mixture of glitters in salads and then those fun clay piece glitters i just think they're really really pretty and those are not clay glitters they're clay pieces and for today's mani we are going to be doing a press on mani and we're going to be doing the gel method and we're going to dive right into the first color here which is called old fashioned now this color right here is like a warmer nude and i am obsessed with this whole entire collection but this color here is really pretty and you can do a lot of stuff with this color alone. It's a really great staple color for your collection. And I really want to do like an ombre mani with old fashioned and trusty boots. I think that would be a really nice like Thanksgiving rustic type of vibe mani. All right, so I will let you enjoy this mani process and I'll pop back in in a few moments.
right, let's add some more of these fun clay pieces to the nail. So as you can see here, I went in directly with my gel base brush and applied a little bit of that gel base onto the nail without curing the nail, which is perfectly fine. I didn't get any of the powder on the brush. If you do end up getting powder on the brush, then definitely go ahead and wipe that off on a piece of paper towel or a lint-free wipe before you go ahead and place that back in the bottle so you're not contaminating it. But this dip powder really absorbed well into that gel, so I didn't have any contamination. So right now I'm just going ahead and placing any color of those little clay pieces that you like to the nail. Now these are a little bit more heavier, so when you are dipping into the nail, you're not going to get a lot of those pieces, so you will have to hand place them. But they lay super flat in the nail, and I'm patting them down right now, and they are becoming one with that dip powder. So you don't have to worry about that nail being bulky or anything like that, which is really nice. All right, so let's dive in back into this mani process, and I'll pop back in at the end. All right, we're just wrapping up this mani here, and I really like how this mani turned out. I think it's super fun, especially for those cozy weather seasons. This collection is definitely very unique and very earthy tone colors, which I really, really like. And I like how we did the matte finish on that old-fashioned color. It just really made that mani pop, and there's just something about the worn-out favorite jeans color here with those clay pieces in there that I'm obsessed with and it laid really flat to the nail so it's not like bulky or anything like that so i really like that about the dip powder so i will go ahead and link everything we use in today's video in the description box below and i'll see you in the next upload